Horses are on the track for Balmoral's first race. First half of tonight's early daily double, a one-mile pace. Nine starters, no changes. Post time in eight minutes. This is the first half of tonight's early double. Perfect and one dollar superfect wagering. Here's the field led by our marshal Jerry Nogan, number one. Tandem Lobel, Steve Searle driving. Two is Crombie's wager, Kim Vincent. Three Emerald Pride will be handled by Brent Holland. Four is Log House and Neil Coleman. Number five, Kevin's Goal, Art Gregory Jr. driving. Six, Keystone Switch will be handled by Jeff Croninger. Number seven, Decker Hanover and Dean McGee. Eight is Stylish Evidence, Doug Hamilton rounding out the field for tonight's opener. Number nine, five aces. Tim Wilson Jr. will bring them to the gate, and they'll all be there in seven minutes for Balmoral's first race. No changes in the first race. In the second race, they're off and pacing on the outside. Decker Hanover and Keystone Switch drive out for the lead towards the inside. Tandem Lobel in between horses. Log House, and we have four across the track battling for the lead. Tandem Lobel benefits from the rail. Log House drops in second. Hustling up on the outside. Third is Keystone Switch. Decker Hanover out there. Fourth. Coming away fifth is Crombie's Wager Emerald Pride. Sixth. Racing in seventh. Kevin's Goal in eighth position down to the quarter. Stylish Evidence. Five aces is the early trailer off a quarter in 28 and four. By the grandstands for the first time. They have one more trip around this. Five eighths oval and Keystone Switch leads by two. Racing in second, Tandem Lobel towards the inside, Log House third. Moving first over fourth goes Emerald Pride. Right behind him, fifth is Kevin's goal. Trapped inside, sixth is Decker Hanover. Five aces, third over on the outside, seventh, and he's about six from the leader. Then it's Crombie's wager in trailing the field, but on the move, stylish evidence. Half was in 58 and three. On the mid-back stretch, Keystone switch on the inside, Emerald Pride on the outside. These two battle head-and-head, -head, nose and nose for the lead. Gaining ground on the outside, third goes Kevin's goal. Tandem Lobel drops back fourth on the outside. Loghouse comes on fifth. Five aces, gains ground six. Decker Hanover's in all sorts of trouble on the rail. He's getting pushed back by Tandem Lobel. Three quarters and 127 flat. They turn for home in the opener. Your leader is Keystone Switch. Emerald Pride hanging second. Kevin's goal is the danger as he tips wide for the drive. They're an eighth of a mile away. It's Keystone Switch, the leader. Closing ground, second Emerald Pride. Racing in up on the outside. Kevin's goal. Keystone Switch. Kevin's goal's coming to him on the outside. Keystone Switch is going to hold on. Maybe. Can't split him. Keystone Switch and Kevin's goal. We know Emerald Pride third. Decker Hanover fourth to complete the Superfecta. In Balmoral's first race, that's a photo finish. Please hold all tickets in the photograph. Six, Keystone Switch, and five, Kevin's goal. Please hold all tickets. Let's go to Maywood. Ladies and gentlemen, we are 12 minutes away from the first race, first half of the early daily double here at Maywood Park. And ladies and gentlemen, just one change on tonight's 11 race card here at Maywood, and that change in this very first race. Rod Mills drives number six, Sammy Rad. Number six, Sammy Rad, make the driver... Rod Mills in this first at Maywood. We're 11 minutes away. Tonight's first race is official. We'll have return prices in a moment. Going into the winner's circle, six Keystone Switch. Keystone Switch is owned by Phyllis Jacobs, trained and driven to victory by Jeff Croninger. Keystone Switch, a track program selection by Kathy Clocker and Sulky Sam Jr. We had a, we had a claim in tonight's first race. First of all, let me give you the payoffs. The 6-5 Perfecta pays $31 even. 6-5 Perfecta, $31 even. The Superfecta, 6-5, 3-7, $326.50. 6-5, 3-7, 326.50.